Hi friends, this is Grandpa from Grandpa's Gaming Garage bringing you a quick walkthrough on how to get the scavenger tools. I've had several people mention on my videos on my walkthroughs that they'd like to know how to get these tools, so I'm going to take you right through it. You want to start out on story mode on episode 7, The Force Awakens. Now you're going to start with you got to start with some other characters, but once you get to the planet with Rey, about two or three quests in, you're going to get a quest called Scrap for scraps basically this is where she goes and gathers scraps in the movie and pays for her own food uh, but once you get in through to the star destroyer it's pretty darn quick you're going to get all the tools and these will open up all the tools for all your scavenger class uh, it's pretty fantastic pretty quick uh, relatively easy there's only one little spot where you need to know something but that's about it and i'll tell you when i get there so the table for the scraps for scraps is located in the back you're going to get your first tool, which is the net launcher. So as you proceed to the back where the quest indicator is, you're going to come across a little workbench and you're going to create your first net launcher. It's going to take you through a quick tutorial on how to use it. Essentially, you're just going to be pointing it at these uh, wall places where they have the white X's on them. Where they ever have the white X's on, you're going to be able to Equip your net launcher and then just cast it, cast a net, place the net right on the wall. Pretty quick, pretty easy. Tells you how to bring up your scavenger menu, which is really easy. Uh, if you have a scavenger app, all you have to do is press and hold the E button. Press and hold the E button and then you select the tool you want and then press space and it automatically does. If you drop it, you can craft it as many times as you want. You don't have to worry about losing these tools. It's always there for you. You're going to go up to this ladder, you're going to collect a couple more scraps, and there will be your workbench for your glider. See what I mean? It's going to be quick, it's going to be pretty easy. So just like with the net launcher, it's going to give you a quick tutorial on how to use it. Once you uh, equip it or fabricate it. And same thing, you can drop this thing at any time. It doesn't matter, you always have it available. You can craft it anytime you want. You're just gonna glide right over to the other side. And you're gonna push this box over the ledge. It's gonna smash on the ground, which is good. Smash open this box here if you want to or not. Then you're gonna jump down. And this is the only part that you could possibly miss is when you get down there you're going to do this and then you're going to build something like a spring the springboard is going to throw you up to the next level you have to do it and bb8 has to do it as well because he's going to be the one that helps you get to the next level up higher Once you get BB-8 up there, you're going to have to grapple up to the next level with BB-8. And this is where I learned my point about droids and their grapple. Um, you keep falling if you just use the jump button. So what you have to do is you have to press forward when you're at that grapple point, when you're at the top. Press forward and do a double jump and it brings you up onto the level. If you don't do it that way, you're going to keep dropping. It's pretty frustrating, but that's just the way the mechanics of the game works. He said push forward double jump and he gets up there no problem now he's going to drop the ladder the ladder for ray ray's going to come up the ladder and then use her glider to get across the other side And once you're there to the other side, you'll be able to craft your last tool. The breaker blaster. Very useful tools. You're going to need them. 
throughout the galaxy there's all kinds of puzzles and stuff like this where you're going to need these tools so it's a pretty important video i really encourage you to watch it again if you need to or get these tools as soon as you possibly can it really enhances the gameplay if you like this video give it a big thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe turn your notifications on thank you for watching